Hey guys, today I'm loading up some uh, 350 lights and, and right now I'm doing the cast bullets. Um, I wanted to show you the difference between uh, when I taper crimp and when I don't taper crimp. Now I don't have a real 350 uh, case case so I'm going to use the 357 just for an example. I put a player on the case so the uh, Oh, it will go into the case without scraping the powder off. So if I just uh, seat the bullet, the case the case will not go down in there at all. So what I'm going to do is uh, taper crimp. I have the RP, RCBS uh, taper crimp. And it's important not to over crimp or your case will go up into the barrel and then after you taper crimp it then the bullet or the case goes down into the, the quasi barrel. So it's, like I said it's important not to over crimp it but you do need to taper crimp it in order to get rid of the case bell. Okay I have a bunch of them uh, seated and now I'm going to use the RCBS uh, taper crimp. Uh, let me show you before I crimp it. Can't get the, can't get the case to go in there in the 357 case checker at all. So taper crimp it. Do another one. So it is important to uh, bell the case so you don't scrape the powder off the bullet. But it's also important to crimp it afterwards to get rid of the bell. Otherwise, it, it won't uh, re, uh, it won't go in the barrel very well, and you might have a failure to fire because of that. It's important not to over crimp it because then the case will go up into the barrel to a point where firing pin won't get the uh, won't strike the primer I don't know if there is a uh, 350 legend case gauge but I don't have one so this, this works. This is an even uh, 350 uh, taper crimp. That's for a 357 also. When the 350 came out, uh, loading dies were pretty hard to come by. So I got what I could. the case and you need to crimp the case. Okay there you have it. I have uh, 180 grain jacketed soft point, 190 grain cast bullets, and 200 grain jacketed soft points. Ready to go. Let's see you at the range. Okay, I'm at the range, I'm at the 100 yard with the uh, 
350 legend and first up is the 180 grain jacketed soft point Okay, next up is the 190 grain cast bullets. Okay, next up is the 200 grain jacketed soft points. Okay, I'm going to go get the target because I don't want to get the camera wet. It's raining. Okay, this is the uh, 180 grain jacket of soft points. This is the uh, cast bullets. A little spread out. Here's the uh, 200 grain Check it, it's off point. Okay, I put the target back down there and I'm going to shoot again. See if we can be a little bit consistent. Okay, here's the 180 grain jacket of soft points. And actually the uh, cast bullets tightened up a little bit. I don't know if they like a warm barrel or what the deal is. This is a 200 grain jacket of soft points. Okay, I did go to the 60 yard line, but something happened or my camera got put on a wrong setting and I didn't record any of it. So anyway, here's what I got at the 60 yard line. I think I like that 60 yard line. It makes me look like a better shot.